Smirnov, two European Championship medals to his name. So, Belarmino Pereira, Smirnov, Kimura, Dorsman, Young, Tomita, Serbin, Gunnarsson. There we say a great start from uh, Dorsman. He has got a brilliant underwater and he comes out in front alongside of Young Bozun, but it looks to be the uh, Japanese swimmer going in three, Kimura, who is keeping pace and in fact now going beyond Dorsman. Yeah, Kimura, he actually moved to, to the United States for a bit to train with the same coach as Brad Snyder. Brad Snyder, a previous gold medalist in this SM11 classification. So it's interesting to see how this training pays off. Now, into the backstroke for Dorsman. He had a good he had a good kick underwater heading into this backstroke. Right now, his backstroke, it looks great. It looks tight. It looks straight. Good clean water entry. Kimura hugging. Uh, now he's veering a little bit. Before he was hugging that lane, that's going to cost him a little bit. And Dorsman into the lane. Dorsman, he needs to continue hugging it and try to stay as straight as he possibly can. This is Dorsman, arguably his strongest stroke in the backstroke. He is uh, the peerless individual. You can see almost five in a line. Contesting for second at the moment, a little bit of an advance from Mikhailo Serbin, but Tomita and Young have made up some ground as Kimura has lost some undoubtedly. Dorsman touches nearly three and a half seconds ahead at the uh, at the 100 mark. The world record holder looking to extend his advantage here with the breaststroke, but he might be caught by a few, including Serbin, who's very good at the breaststroke, and Young also making up ground. Yeah, uh, Dorsman was actually ahead of his own world record mark at the turn going into this breaststroke, but he needs to get through this breaststroke. This is not his strongest stroke. And so you can see some of the other swimmers start to make their move, but Dorsman, he's got a phenomenal freestyle coming home. He really does. And Rogier Dorsman has uh, got through the breaststroke and he's well and truly in front. He touches in 145.48. He's a... Uh, Looking good for a world record on here. He is eight seconds ahead of Young Bozun, who touches second, and Nikailo Serbin in third. There is Dorsman, and then everybody else challenging for a medal. The only real challenge for Dorsman is himself. He's hugging the lane rope to his right to try and keep himself a little straighter. Coming to the wall in world record time here, surely the Dutch swimmer, who is the world record holder, the Paralympic record holder, and world champion, is going to come home to be Paralympic Games champion as he makes his debut in this event with another gold and a world record to boot. The battle for silver here is on. Serbin looks to have the advantage. And Young Bozun touches, does he? No, it's Tomita who beats him at the wall. Mikhailo Serbin, silver and bronze for Tomita as the home favourite picks up a medal and on the podium. But Dorsman, you just can't keep this man down. He got his turns right, maybe a little more speculative at the wall. It looked like his tapper was almost touching him later in an effort to cause him to go to the wall a little harder. And look how brilliantly he comes off the blocks here. You know he was mad about that 100-meter backstroke, and so he went out hard in the fly. He immediately hit the lane line a bit, but then he started to hug it, and he stayed close to it. Fly was not his best leg, but he still he put in a good, a solid fly leg, and then he came into the backstroke, backstroke, one of his best here, and he really just started to take it. He pulled way ahead. He was veering a bit in the backstroke into the lane, but once he crashed, he used the crash now to correct himself and to hug the lane. Here he is into the breaststroke, and what may not be his strongest leg, he still looked, had a great stroke. He continued to stay ahead of the rest of the pack, and then he came into the freestyle. You see the tap there. He kind of glides into the wall, but he was way ahead of world record pace. Dorsman has got to be happy with that swim after the struggles he had in the 400 and then definitely in the 100 backstroke. Uh, to put it into perspective how good he is, he still went on to win gold in the men's 400-meter freestyle S11 despite missing the wall on a turn, gaining no pace off that wall. That's a grand bronze for uh, Japan as Tomita Uchu picks up a bronze. But for Netherlands, his assistant just signals to him that he can wave and acknowledge those who are applauding his performance. So the world record has gone. 2.19.02 takes over a second off his world record. But amazingly, he got through his breaststroke leg without much trouble, and that really was going to be key as to whether or not he would be challenged. Ultimately, nobody came close. Mikhailo Serbin, so strong with the breaststroke and the uh, freestyle, who was 
nowhere near the front after the opening two legs at 227.97. Almost uh, a full nine seconds down on Dorsman and Tommy Tauchu. He picks up his second medal of the games after a silver in the 400 free. Tommy Tauchu picks up a bronze in the 200 IM. But in world record time, it is Roger Dorsman of the Netherlands who has uh, brought home his second gold in world record time, 2.19.02.